Berries. Today I'm back in the Ambry's Next Up model house and I listened to a lot of your guys' suggestions, which I asked yesterday, of what you think I should do with the empty room and all your ideas. And I came straight on after I read your comments and I started fixing and doing things that you wanted me to do. So I wanted to show you today what I have done. So thanks to you guys, because this is all your ideas, not my ideas. So yeah, let's go and look at the new changes to the house. Right, so. I will show you the comments too. One of probably the, I think it's one of the most liked comments was that you guys think that I should add in a diary room type thing where we can speak to the camera. So I made, this is actually, to be honest, the only problem is, is that, you know, there's a garage out front. Yeah, that's not an actual garage. It's just for show, like nothing. You cannot park what? anything here. No, yeah. I could, I could get my, hold on Amber, wait. Wait one second, okay? Hold that thought. I know something I could park in there actually. It would keep you very safe. Cool. Uh, hold on. Very nice. Let me just get that close. Hey! Hey, oh, hey, hey! hey. The camera's hating you! My head! Oh, see, but perfect fit. Perfect fit. We'll just leave hey. you in there for the rest of it. Help me! I will open it for you again. But yeah, you can leave your bag. Oops. Whoa. My head's back. We reversed it. We reversed it. I was trying to knock on there, but it wasn't working. You can't yeah, knock so on a garage door. All the models now have to ride bikes, otherwise their cars will be unsafe. Yeah, you probably fit about two bikes in there, so... <laughs> it's alright, they can just park out front, it's just for show. But anyway, what I've put there behind that is the diary room. And so one thing that I thought of is that you need to know if people are in the diary room first before you go in there. So this is why I put the open and close sign in there. So if it's closed, you know someone's in there talking, could be talking bad about you, who knows? But yeah, so you can just change that to close when people someone is in there. So I'm going to put it to close and I'll show you what this looks like now. Aww. Right, it's so beautiful. I've done like, like these decals to make it look like it's a, you know, they always have like this kind of patterned, kind of soft material walls, I feel like, with diary rooms in Big Brother or any other place, I feel like. And this is obviously the chair. And then this is the camera, which we speak to. So, you know, I could have been saying like, oh, we're chicken. The chicken is so annoying. I just want Excuse him me? voted out. Vote him out, please. The judges. door is open here. The door you left the door open. I can hear everything you're <gasps> saying. Okay. See which you want. You have a go. Please. All right. Fine. I'm closing the door though. Hold on. You want me to close the door? <gasps> I bet you'll turn. Okay. This is the only problem, oh. right? Is that because he's turned lights off? But sometimes when <laughs> you put something too close, yeah, it starts turning them off. So be careful with that. Make sure you're on it and then press E. E. Okay, well, e. I suppose you press E to turn it off as well. <laughs> like it's a different button, but still. All right. Hello, diary room. This is chicken here. Big for chicken. Listen, I have got a few problems with Anne Berry. Okay, she's very rude. She wants me voted off. She decapitates me with the garage door. There's nowhere to keep my car because this is where it should be here. But this is not the garage and it should be. I'm absolutely fuming. So yeah. Hashtag boat off and berry. Kick her off the show. We're chicken for the win. Okay, hey. Hi, hey, Amber. Hey, bestie. Whoa. Hey. I hope you win this show, by the way. Just then you know. Is that what you were saying in there? I was, oh, you should have you should have heard me bigging you up to the public. I was like, oh, Anne Berry's the best. You know, you, got the you were a liar. I had my ear to the door. I heard everything. Oh, oh no. Oh, no, I've, got come back. Escape. I've got to make an escape. <laughs> oh, I'll come back. Okay, so another suggestion you guys had was actually about the runway place. And someone said that they think that I should turn the lights off. Like, I do have a lot of lights because I hate when the rooms are dark. But for this, obviously, that's a good thing. And just have the, these lights as the main focus. So I did have to turn on some lights because with some of these off, let me turn these off to show you. But if he was over here, then it'd be too too dark and the runway was too thin. So you still want the runway to be on so you can see the people coming on. So Rich said we could turn some of them on, but most of them off. It highlights whoever's coming down the runway. Like if you sit at the judge's seat, these chairs over here are really dark because you don't want to see the people watching. You yeah, want to see you the models. Them. You want to focus. If Rich Chicken is walking out in a great new suit, you don't want to be watching the people watching him. You want to see Rich Chicken working exactly. his magic on wow, the Wow, wow, wow. Beautiful. Sitting down, 
Dragging some posies. Whoa. Oh, you want, you want some picture over here? Oh, you want a picture and berry? There you go. That's what that one's for free. And then Richie walked off. Yeah, right. That's a good suggestion. It really it adds is. the It did add. The room. I thought it was a really good idea, so I tried it out and I'm keeping it. Good suggestion, <laughs> guys. Right, so the last thing is you guys wanted me to do something with well. I asked you guys what do you think I should do with the room upstairs? And I had a lot of suggestions. I had some people say runway. Um, I had like to have another runway, like a practice one. Some people just said just have like another seating area. The most thing that people wanted me to do was build like a little photo shoot area. Cause that could be like another thing for people to do. Like another task. They'll do a photo shoot and then they'll do a runway. So that is exactly what I did here. As you can see, I did actually put a couch here though. So it is a bit, a bit of a reception area too. Yeah, well, the, the models can watch, you know, when they're getting prepared or if it's their turn next. So let me show you the photo shoot area. As you can see, it's like, uh, I don't know what you call these things here, like the white It's things. like a, a canvas, like a blank canvas kind of thing. Kind of, yeah. I don't know what the actual official term is. Professional but, term, yeah. Yeah, but that is basically what that is. So they stand, they sort of clear background, you know, for that. And then I added this, I know this is a like a drink thing, well not a drink thing, it's like a cooler thing, right? That you take away and camping and whatever. But I thought it looked like it'd be a good place to put like camera equipment. So I thought that looked cool. And Oops. let me tell you, I tried for ages to try and make something look like a camera. And I know it doesn't look exactly like a camera, but this is the best I could do. So I got an, e so an easel. I think it might be called an easel, yeah. So I got an easel and I basically just added a speaker to it to make it look like it. So it looks like it's a bit like a tripod kind of thing. I wish I could get, I was trying to get a speaker, yeah? And I was trying to put it all the way on top of there. I wish on Bloxburg you could just like put things on top of things sometimes. It'd be so good if you could just, if it was a bit like Minecraft, how you could just add something on top of anything. There's no restrictions. Cause then you could be more creative and turn something else into it. Cause imagine if that was up there, it looked more like a camera, but it's fine. It's only for the look of it. So yeah, so people can be here taking pictures and that goes straight to the comp um, computer back here. So they start looking at it straight away to be able to tell if it's a good picture or not. So let's have a let's have a little check. Rich, go on, take a pic. Oh, do you want me, do you want me to take a oh, picture of me? Yeah. Me, hold on, let me, put, let me do my signature pose. Hold on. Get ready because this doesn't last long. <gasps> Ching. Thank you. Yeah, one more just in case we'll have a... Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh, I got that. Right, so then I go nice. to the camera here. Let's have a quick look. Oh my word, is that how I look? Yeah. Wow, I am beautiful. Gorgeous, aren't you? Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, do I really look like that? Yeah, you do. Is that you me? Do. That was you, it was you. I am gorgeous. It might be these lights that you added in, you know, these little decals. Oh yeah, so this is another thing I added in was these decals and it, it's not supposed to look like it's like oh, these two are supposed to, but the lights up top are supposed to be like that's making it you know, giving something. But this was just supposed to be almost like put away to the side. Because normally when people have lights, they'll put it out in front. But I couldn't find anything like it. So I just put these lights at the side as if I'm just like, you know, putting them away, storage kind of thing. But I do think it really gives the, the look as if it really is like a photo shoot area. It does, especially with the lights up top that are real. Uh, yeah. It, when you combine them, like you can turn it. These are actual lights, aren't they? Yeah. They're actually aimed at the photo shoot area. So I think it looks really good rather than just having because if I if you asked me to make this I'd have done the white floor white wall I would have wouldn't have come up with the camera idea I would have had nothing there and it would have been like yes yeah, where we take pictures but you have added in little decals and stuff it's smart Amber yeah right I'm gonna show you guys how to make a few things while we're here just in case because I've got a lot of questions of how to do things so I'm gonna quickly show you right so one question I get is how to make this have two different tone wall and it's really really easy. So all you do is you go to get any picture, whatever one you think fits. I'm trying to find a room that doesn't have it in. You could do it to this room actually. So all you do is just get like one of these, make sure it's on small so you could fit it in properly. And you add it in like this. Right, so then you go to search and then I just look up white. You click on that and then one bam, it's done. And then you just make loads of them in a line, add them up. Um, it can be sometimes hard, sometimes you have to crisscross them a bit to make it like go in with stuff. I've had to move doors out of the way sometimes for that. But that's how you do that. Right, another thing. Hmm. Oh, no. I'll show you how I've done the thing downstairs, the padding. Right, now with the padding, that was really easy too. It's the exact same thing. Well, not the exact same. So I think I use this one because it covers a big area like this. Now, I put two down like this for you. 
I'll delete these afterwards, obviously. And this is what I made on Photoshop anyway. All right, so with the first one, this is the number here. Just add it in, really simple. Then it changes to that. And that's obviously what I've done all around the room. Made it like that. And I had to like move a bit up and move a little bit down. So this is probably like trying to find the right thing so it looks like it fits nicely. And then I'll put another one here. And then with the last one, which is the camera one, all I've done with that is that it was the exact same background and then I added a camera in front of it to make it look like, you know, it's just in front of it like that. So it's, it's the same image but with a camera there, like that. So then it kind of looks like that. So it's really easy. And I'll put the decals of that down below. If any of you want to make it, some of you probably don't, but I'm just, you know, just in case you do, because I do get asked about decals a lot. So it's very easy. And that's how you do that. Just so you can come into my tutorial. You made me a guest so I can do what I like. Well, I, can now, I, can, I can make you not a guest. Okay? No, 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 you can't. I'm running away now. Oh, do you like that? Look, can you see? Look, I'm showing them how I've done oh, that. Oh, nice. Yeah. You can actually see it flat like that. Oh, one thing is I actually my... made it a bit lower so you could put the lights in there because you can't put lights on top of pictures. But yeah, go say what you were saying. I was going to make a silly joke. Go on, let's see the silly joke. I was going to say the camera's a bit high. So if, you, if I was recording here, I'd have to jump. Oh, you just sat on my head. Words. Yeah, stand up. Hold on, hold on. Oh no! Can you not stand on people's heads? See ya! Oops. Oh no! Yes. I, I couldn't find the button! It didn't yeah. come up! We're chicken. Oh, and by the way, this part here is just basically, I made a floor of, and it's just all white here. And then I added posters in like I did downstairs. And that's all white and I tur turned them all white and I put, put them like that. So that's really easy as well. Nothing too difficult. But yeah, that's basically all the things I have done. Oh, and I had a good idea as well. So. With the photo shoot thing, I was, wasn't sure what I was going to do was I said that I would do a runway. What you can do with the photo shoot thing is that you basically make your own photo shoots. If we give you a theme or something and then you guys come out and then you're like, hmm, what should I do? And you can go into the closet area, pick your outfit and then you can tell us what props you want to use and stuff like that. So if you guys are like, oh, I want to make mine on a beach thing, it goes with your outfit or blah, 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 then we can do that. And we could even change the background color or something like that. For you so i would just go into build mode listen to what you want because obviously we'll do models photo shoots one by one then i could just add in you know got this here all right and then you could put the, you know this in here and then that's your little place you know and that could be a little photo shoot oh so, yeah. we can edit it because that's why they have the white canvas we can edit stuff in exactly in i could make this for instance look like sand there you go, there's your little area. And then you can do a little photo shoot. The only thing is I'd have to change the side. But I guess I could make it a sky. Let's have a look. <clears throat> right, see, Ooh. look. Beachy, beachy. Oh, wow, that does look like sand. Hold on, can you take a picture of me now then? Let me see if I can get a sky. It does not go, but you know I mean, you know what I'm saying. Anyway, they're going to stand there. I can take a pic. What do you mean stand? I'm not standing. I'm sitting. Oh, see, yeah, look. Photo shoot ready. Wow. Yeah, take it. Woo. How, do, how does the chicken look? The chicken on the beach, this one's called. The only problem is, is that you haven't changed your suit, so it kind of doesn't go, but that's I fine. I wear the suit everywhere. I wear yeah. the suit everywhere I go. Yeah, see, and that's what we can do for it. So they can pick their own props, their own photos. They change their clothes, and we take the pictures. Afterwards, we compare. We say the good ideas and stuff like that, and that's how we will decide. Oh, also, most people said they wanted to be a roleplay series, so I'll go into that, which does make sense, because otherwise, you know, it can't have as much drama. Because if I saw someone being nasty to someone, in here and they meant it then i'd have to chuck them out anyway because i couldn't stand it but if it's fake drama then it's fine oh if you're wondering why i'm wearing this because it was for the thumbnail picture but then i just left it on but yeah, i quite like Beautiful. it yeah it's very because that's what i want to wear i want to wear sassy things not like an everyday outfit i feel like tyra banks always dresses you know very stylish every episode so i'm going to change my outfit every episode to something very cool <laughs> so yeah that is it i hope you guys like the changes let me know if you have any other suggestions thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys liked it and i'll see you guys next time bye bye guys